the demolition of over 350 flats and posh complexes, which is one of the largest demolition drives in India involving residential complexes, which began on Saturday, continued today with one more complex being demolished this morning. Now, these buildings are being demolished on the instructions of the top court for violating environmental rules. In fact, two of these four high rises were raised on Saturday. The fourth complex will be demolished today at around 2 p.m. Let's go over to Sneha Mary Koshi, who is uh, at that location for an update. Uh, Sneha, in the visuals, we can see a dust and a debris clouds that have enveloped the area. You know, has this uh, dust settled in? What kind of precautions, what kind of reactions are you hearing? Well, Ruby, this is one of the, this is the largest complex out of the four complexes that are being demolished uh, since yesterday. This is the largest complex, has around over 100 flats in this particular complex. And if you see uh, visually also, it's completely surrounded by the backwaters. Uh, the demolition, when it was demolished, the building just came, um, it just came crashing down. Most of the debris is in debris are inside the boundary wall itself. So right. that, according to officials, has been, uh, has been largely a success. Now, there will be another one, uh, which will be at 2 o'clock. Uh, in this particular case, uh, it, uh, officials say the preliminary estimates uh, show that everything has happened in the way that it was planned. Uh, the debris eventually will be taken away by a company that has been given the tender by the local municipality. Uh, as usual, there was uh, one, six, one forty four section uh, for the 200 meters in and around that area. People were not allowed, people were evacuated from in and that area. But unlike what we saw yesterday, this is not a very densely populated area. So that challenge perhaps was left. But even in terms of the backwaters and everything, though there might be some some things that really fell in, but m much of the debris really has fallen within the boundary wall. And that, according to officials, is a success.